Right. Let's have a look up here, shall we? It won't open. Oh, no, typical. Let's qu quietly sneak past. There's a patrolling policeman there, so we're trying to avoid him. And here we come to a safe point. Woohoo! And what appears to be a room down there. The window's smashed. I can see what looks like an old dark room. Oh, I'll have to have a look at that later, I think. Anyway, let's have a quick scave. And let's move on. Basically, we're going to try and get to the store. Let's just see how that goes, shall we? There's a copper down here somewhere. Let's just wait till he goes past. I can't hear him. Just the wind. I know you're here somewhere, Mr. Cop. Mmm, creepy noises. Okay, seriously. Ah, there we go. Right, what I'm going to have to do is wait for him to come back again. And then we'll sneak past him. If you get caught, nothing really happens, so you get chucked um, back outside and he says, Sorry, stranger, don't come in here. Rawr. And it's like, okay, fair enough, can't come in here. Come on. He's got Metal Gear Solid Syndrome, he can't look to the left. Or the right, even. And that suits me just fine. Anyway. It's unlocked. Excellent. Basically, that says if there's scratch marks on the floor, it means we can push things in front of stuff, which becomes very useful for later on. But for now, it's like a little tutorial. So what we're gonna do? I'm gonna stop the copper coming in. Oh God, where are my feet? Anyway, oh my arms. Ah, I'm using my head. That must really hurt. Anyway, that's pushed. Assorted paperwork, but nothing of any real interest. All right. Ah, for a ticket. Hmm. Watch out for medical bots. So they contain all the treatments needed to patch up any injuries. You can apply treatments through the uh, treatments uh, treatments through either the interface or the quick heal key. Uh, I always use the interface because it's easier to see what's going on. Anyway, let's go around and grab that. It looks like I need some sort of lifting handle to get it open. Is that a fact? Well, we can look for one. We're not going to open that door because that goes outside. Just loads of adverts around here. An empty store. Looks like it's been cleaned out. I wonder who could have done that. Empty till. The till's empty. Damn. No money for you, Looks Jack. Looks like the door was forced open, and there's scratch marks on the wood. Okay. This is where I start getting worried. Safe's open. There's a bottle of bootleg rum and a wooden handle. Score. Whoa. Ooh. Copper's trying to get him by the sound of it. It probably leads down to a storage yep. cellar. Yep, so what we're going to do, use wooden handle, along with the trap door. And let's get the hell out of here. Oh! Ouch. You're really unlucky with stairs and ladders, aren't you, Jack? Thanks, police officer. Thanks a lot. <sighs> Honestly. Okay, we're in a cellar. Hey, a diary. Let's have a look. What's that then? The diary of Byron Burnham. Well, I agree with the locals on one thing. I shouldn't be stuck in this miserable excuse for a town. I can see why nobody comes here, that's for sure. Another slow day at the store. At first I thought people were staying away because the first national isn't local. But I haven't seen anyone going to any of the other stores either. Come to that, I haven't seen the other stores open for business. This place is deader than dead. Still, it won't be long before I'm out of here. Before we're both out of here. She's the one good thing about Innsmouth. We'll bust open an old man's way safe. Take a car, and then it's New York City. Bright lights, nightlife, everything.
I'll share all of it. It has some clues, Jack. It does. Yeah, not a chance to get up here anyway. Hey. This looks like a plan, huh? Yeah! Nice one! The walls collapsed. It must have already been badly damaged on one side. Yeah, and I'm still trying to get through it. There we go. Ooh, dead people. The cellar's filled with human remains. Nice. These people must have died a long time ago. Hey, it's that dark room. Andy. Let's have a quick look. Old photos of Innsmouth. Most of them have faded beyond recognition. Eh. Uh, oh well. Let's move up. Oh, they're in someone's house. Oh well, let's just have to break in, won't we? Ooh, ammo. Basically, we can start picking up ammo from now. Unfortunately, we still don't have a gun. The old printing press appears to have been sabotaged. No new news in Innsmouth, then. Hmm. That must be the way out. Let's have a look. Let's explore a bit. It won't open. Okay. Whoa! Holy shit! I agree with that. I think she's dead. Extension here. This noose broad must have kicked it a few months back. And um, yeah, it probably wasn't the good idea to look at that. Anyway, I don't think there's anything useful. Don't think there's anything that useful now. Just dead lady. Hang on. Nothing of interest here. No, nope, guess not. Go on, Jack. Out we go. So, pick up what's left of my heart in my chest, and let's move on. And we can unlock a door. This is another little tutorial, if you like. It shows you how we can unlock the door. Which we also need when we're running the hell away from people later on. Aha! Hello, Jack. Ooh, a suspicious stranger. Do I know you? Lucas Mackey. Sorry to startle you. Insmith doesn't get a lot of visitors. New names spread fast. What are you doing in town, Jack? Hear about the missing Burnham boy? Not bad. Clan's a friend of the Burnhams. Seen the latest press from Arkham? Your boy's been quite busy. Hmm. What about you, Mackie? You're obviously not a local. What's your business in town? <laughs> True enough, Jack. Nothing too exciting, I'm sorry to say. I'm a government factory inspector. Oh, blatant lies. Blatant they posted lies. me in this rotten hole to check over the old Marsh refinery. Speaking of which, I've got an appointment with the manager, Jacob Marsh. Okay. Maybe I'll catch you later. That was, uh... That's the first friendly face I've seen in this damn town. But I've been in this business long enough to know he's hiding something. Yeah, but anyone in any business could realize that, since he's a filthy liar. <laughs> And let's save it. And that'll be it for this video. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. And the next one should be a bit quicker than this one. So, until next time. Toodles.